Hey everyone, it's Delaney, Inbound Marketing Specialist at Hive House Digital. Today, we're going to show you how to use Playbooks in HubSpot. Playbooks are a tool in HubSpot you can use to provide guidance for your team members to reference and create standard notes when talking to leads and customers. They can be used on a contact, company, deal, or ticket record. Some ideas for Playbooks are discovery call templates, renewal conversations, and customer onboarding. To access Playbooks, you can find it in the Sales drop-down menu. Once you're there, click the orange Create Playbook button. You can either choose to build from scratch or use one of the templates to start out with. Go ahead and add in your title and click again the orange Create Playbook button. Now you have the text editor open and you can go ahead and add in the questions or prompts you'd like your team members to ask. You can always go ahead and change the title up here. And then right here is where you can introduce the purpose of your playbook or add any instructions you want your team members to keep in mind when talking to leads or customers. To add in a question, you can go ahead and click the Q&A button in the editor tool and type in your question. From there, you need to choose an answer type. Open text means that your rep can take notes in an open text field. There's not really any limitations, it's just free writing. You can also choose a list of answer options, but this is limited to enterprise users only. This will give you a drop down list of answer options, and you can select one or multiple options. Another answer type that is limited to enterprise users only is updating properties. So this would automatically update a property on a contact company deal or ticket record. Once you choose your answer type, you can go ahead and click Save. If you need to edit the question, go ahead and hover over the field and click Edit. And then you can go ahead and click Save and it will update. From here, you can go ahead and add in as many questions or prompts as you need. You can also embed videos or links that you would like to include in your playbook. I'm not gonna add in one of those for now, but next up we need to go to settings to configure a few things. So first you can choose how you want your playbook to be logged as. You can choose a call, meeting, email, or a note. I'm gonna select call, and then you can also select a default call type if you'd like. So for this one, I'm going to do a discovery call. Next, a new feature in HubSpot is to create recommendations for playbooks. So based on a set of rules, this playbook will show up on a contact profile or company or deal record, and it will suggest this playbook if they have the right properties um, selected. So what you have to do is click Create Rule, and then for this one, I'm going to choose Lifecycle Stage is any of lead. Then you can click Save, and you have created your rule. Once you are all set, you can go ahead and click Publish, and you have published your playbook. So now let's show you how you can use these on an actual contact profile. So here we are on my contact profile, and as you can see in the playbook section, it is recommending that the tech tip playbook I just made because I have a lifecycle stage of lead. If you want to use another playbook, if you have more than one, they will also show up here, and you can go ahead and select that. When you click on a playbook, it will open up a pop-up, which will allow you to take notes, but also access other things on your screen. As you are on your call, you can go through the prompts or questions provided. Depending on the use case, this may be more rigid or it may be more fluid. If you're logging a call, you can go ahead and select an outcome. So for this one, we would obviously choose connected because if you're recording a playbook, you probably connected with them. And then you can also create a task to follow up if you wish. Once you're done, you can go ahead and click log call. And we can see on our activity that it logged a call and it shows you all of your notes here, as well as like the outcome, the time, anything you might need to know regarding this call. Let's say there's a lot more activity on my profile right now. You can always go back and find it by clicking on the calls tab and any log calls will show up here. That's all we have for playbooks today. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on our next tech tip.